Here we are. Raise the gate! It's time to go see Mary, dearest. Hey, Mary, are you in here? I'm tired from running around all day. I could really go for a good dick sucking right now. Alright, let's use the video. It looks like I can't use that yet. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, wait, do I have to stand in front of the VCR? Okay, let's try the VCR. How, how specific do you have to be? I'm like... Two, two inches next to the VCR should just use the fucking tape. I'm right there. You wouldn't just be like, oh, I can't stick this in the TV. What do I do with it? Do I eat it? <clears throat> there we go. Slides right in. Like a lubed up cock. Are you taping again? Yeah, we're Come about on. to bang. <sighs> I don't know why. But I just love it here. Is it the fucking lake? It's so peaceful. <laughs> it's so you know fucking peaceful. This you haven't seen the shit I've used seen. To be a sacred place. Oh, was it? I think I can see why. It's too bad we have to leave. No, no, it's not. Please I want to get the fuck out of here. Again, James. <laughs> Bitch, you need a cough drop. Um, what's going on with with the video? Did someone record over my, my porno? What the fuck's this snuff film shit? Mary, psst. Are you awake? Good. Now I can do whatever I want with you. It's okay, Mary. I'll help you sleep better. This is what you get for snoring, Mary. This is what you get for snoring. Take the pillow over your head, bitch. You won't be snoring ever again. I fucking hate snoring. Oh my god, holy shit. <laughs> Sucks, huh? Yeah, isn't that fucking annoying? Stop snoring. That was not a hot video at all. That video was fucking disappointing. No one even came. I know. James, I'm disappointed too. I thought you were going to be doing like doggy or missionary or cowgirl or reverse cowgirl. Or pile driver, or any of those would have been great. I mean, if she's sick, that's fine. She can just lay there, and you can just contort her. You could, you could do uh, spoon. Spoon position's good. I, I don't know why you're so upset. I mean, you can always try this video again with someone else, right? I mean, what about that Angela chick? Think she'd be down for it? You think she'd be down for going down? Oh, I can see you having a moment, James. It's fine. I'll, I'll leave you to your. Your regret and, and, and sadness. Mary. Now I know why she hates him. So there you are, James. Did you get the letter? Did oh, I didn't get a letter. letter. If not, let's get going on. I got a okay. fucking reality check, though. Oh, are you gonna fucking smother her too? Mary's gone. I know. She's dead. Liar! That's a lie. No, that's not true. She, she died because she was sick. No, well, she died because she was sick, but she didn't die because of the sickness. No, I killed her. <laughs> Why are you telling the kid this? Holy fucking shit! I know you have to get it off your chest, but to a fucking, like, eight-year-old? Are you kidding me? You kill her! Why'd you do it? I hate you! <laughs> what, what, did... what kind of she reaction were you expecting? I, you just I told an eight-year-old that you her. killed your her. wife. You might as well just tell her. You just fucking told her you killed your wife. You can tell her anything now. Nothing's off limits. Tell her about your deepest, I'm darkest secrets. Sorry. Get everything else off your chest. Tell her about the no, dog no, you no, kicked. No. Isn't tell her about the embezzlement. Tell her about your fantasizing of young girls like her. Tell her anything you want because you just told her you fucking killed your wife. You psycho. You idiot. You moron.
fucking facepalm. You made me facepalm on YouTube. That is the dumbest thing, and you made me do it, James. Wow. Okay. This is ridiculous. What's that noise? I was just watching a really lame porno. Where are you? No, of course not. Well, I mean, maybe I did. I did murder you with a pillow. Noise. Yeah, you were supposed to be waiting in the fucking room. Where are you? Are you in the closet? That's nearby. Let's check the closet. That was the worst fucking porno we made ever. That was all snuff film and no penetration. What a waste. I was looking forward to the porn too, and they fucking ruined it. It's uh, it's dark here. Where's my light? Where's my fucking light? Why isn't my light on? Why isn't my light on? What's that noise? It sounds like a fucking bee's in my skull. I can't fucking go anywhere. Why does my light keep going off? Why does my light keep going off? Did I hit a button that turned off the light? I don't remember hitting a button that turned off the light. So, what the fuck? On! On fucking on. Holy shit, goddamn. Why isn't it staying on? Is this another another bullshit thing, like the bug room, where you can't have your light on? I mean, I know it attracts the monsters, but guess what? It helps me seize the monsters too! I can't see the monsters without the fucking light! Where the hell am I? This doesn't look the same at all. What the fuck? Everything's so dark! Did I go in any of these? Yeah, I went in all of these, but look, they're like, some of these don't look like I've even touched them. I must be in the hell version because I, I've checked all these doors, but this one wasn't open last time. Uh, what the fuck? This looks like the same hallway. Is this more copy and pasted bullshit? No! It, it just teleported me. Okay, um, is this like a fucking puzzle of some sort? Where the fuck am I now? Okay, those two lead the same place. Uh let's let's go up here and check and check this door. No, it's locked. What about you? Well this one, the camera angle's focusing on this one. This has to be an important fucking door, so let's go right through it. Uh was it that important? Uh I guess so. Oh, it's teleporting me on the other side! Oh, oh, that's really fucking stupid. Wow, okay, wow, that's so dumb. Let's check all these doors I didn't get to check. This one's still open. Is this the way I'm supposed to go? Hello? Oh, whoa, maybe I have to listen to this first. I mean, why not just assault your senses? Oh, he didn't want her to die. Down. As her doctor, I promise I'll do what I can. But there's still no effective treatment for her condition. Oh no. How long does she have? Not long. Because you're about I'm to kill her. Sure. Three years at most. Perhaps six months. Hmm. It's impossible to say with certainty. So he killed her because she was going to die anyways, and he wanted to ease her suffering. Was she fit enough to go on one last trip to Silent Hill? You should have just let her die, buddy, because now you're you're fucking stuck here. And you're probably stuck here because of you murdering her. I mean, why else would you be here? Every time someone comes to Silent Hill, it's because they're getting fucking punished for something they did. Like, I don't know, kill their fucking wife. Not sure where I'm going, but I'll, I'll figure it out. Maybe, oh, maybe I just have to go th down to this big door. Maybe it's not as complicated as I'm making it out to be. Maybe I just gotta go through here. Yeah! So I was just teleporting around like a dickhead for no reason. For no fucking reason. I still can't use my light either. Why can't I use my light? I feel like the game's just leading me to its final conclusion. Can I take the elevator at least? I can take the elevator! The elevator fucking works. Uh... I'm not sure which which way to go. I mean, 
Are we on the first floor? We were just on these these two floors, so do we have to go to the basement? Sounds like a horrible fucking place to go. But with this game, it always seems like the right place to go is down. Uh-oh. What the fuck is that? The fuck is that? Oh, what the fuck's running around in the water? I can't shoot it. I can't shoot what's in the water. I don't know what you are. Shoot it. I don't know what you are. Shoot it. Shoot the thing in the water. Can I kick you? Oh, I think you're dead now. I didn't realize I was playing Silent Hill Downpour. I thought this was Silent Hill 2. Where the fuck do I go? There we go. Everything's better down where it's wetter. That's why it's hotter under the water. Yeah, we're in luck here. Monsters get fucked here under the sea. Holy shit, look at all this. Whoa, look at all these health drinks. I hit the jackpot. Thank you, Ba. I mean, they're trying to tell me something. They just gave me five fucking health drinks. What does that tell you? Oh my god, ammo too? Oh, something, something's coming up. I don't know, I don't know what's coming up. They just gave me rifle shells and shotgun shells. I think I think I'm about to fight a boss, probably a, a, an intense, powerful boss too. No, I don't care about the refrigerator. I want the first aid kit. Why are you so focused on the fucking refrigerator? Um, what the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? You hear that? What is that? I hear noises. What was that? Did you hear that? It was like... Rah! Oh, whoa. Whoa, Angela. This is not a safe place to be standing. Are you fucking cold? Because there's better alternatives than standing on a burning staircase. Hey, did I tell you that I killed my wife? I told a little child. Let me tell you. Mama, I was looking for you. Whoa. Did your mom have a sex change? Mom, mom, why are you running away? Oh my god, you delusional cunt. <gasps> You're not my mom. No fucking shit! It's, it's you! <laughs> you didn't mistake me for your mom at the beginning of the game, why would you do it now? Angela, no. Thank you for saving me. You're welcome. I'm glad you came to your senses. But I wish you hadn't. <laughs> yeah, I kind of wish I hadn't said. either. I deserved what happened. No, Angela. That's wrong. To get raped by a table? No one deserves getting raped by a table. I feel your pain. I'm also a survivor. No. Don't pity me. I'm not worth it. If you insist. Can I get by now? Or maybe you think you can save me. Will you love me? I have a pretty bad track record of loving Take women. Take care of me. Heal all my pain. Uh, what's that thing next to you? Was that there before? That's a weird picture. And no, I won't do any of that stuff. I'll probably just That's kill you with a pillow. Thought. James, why don't you just lie and be like, yeah, just come with me. We'll get you help. James. Give me back that knife. If, if you insist, I mean... No, I, no come on, I give mean... it to her. Saving it for yourself? Nope, I didn't even look at the damn thing. Me? N no. I never kill myself. You know, if you want to kill yourself, jump in the fire. Jump in the fire. Like the Metallica song. Yes, she's doing it. Jump in the fire. And tonight we're gonna burn, 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 burn. Tonight we're gonna burn, 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 burn. You see it too. You see the you see the fire burning my skin too. It's always like this. Can I go up after her? Oh, I can't. Hey, wait for me. What 
No, I can't. Wait, come back. I changed my mind. I won't give you the knife, but I'll give you this shotgun to your temple. Well, I don't think we're staying in here. We can't go up those stairs. Um, this isn't the door I came in. This isn't the door I came in at all. My flashlight's still not working. I checked the menu and it's on. It just won't fucking work. The batteries must have run out. Um, what? What? No, get away from me, suction cup monsters. No, you will not suck me today. Okay, where am I now? It's two diamonds. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, the same square god! Yeah, this game's definitely trying to fucking tell me something. Uh, does it want me to save? <laughs> okay, we're gonna die. Let's do this, people. I think we are so close at the end of this game. Let's go to the big scary door. Big scary door. Oh no. What's this? Uh, two doors? Do I get to pick left or right or something? It's really fucking dark in here, especially without my flashlight. Thank you very much. Who's that? Fucking really? You died twice! How are you back again? Just do it. She apparently comes back to fucking life. See you in the next reincarnation, Maria. Ah! Oh, oh, I died again! You've seen this fucking three times, James! Holy shit! How many times are you gonna be a baby? You should be worried about the two assholes with... with triangle heads wielding spears about to hop down and poke you in the butt with them. I was weak. That's why I needed you. I needed someone to punish me for my sins. You're about to get punished in a minute. But that's all over now. I know the truth. Now it's time to end this. How they get down so fast? I didn't even jump down. This is the end of you, Pyramid Man. Holy shit, I got poked in the chest. That wasn't really fun. Shit, run away. James, run away. Run away from the evil that is triangles. Triangles are so damn evil. Might as well just use all my health kits, because, I mean... What's after this? One more fucking boss? Those spears do a shitload of damage. Holy shit, I thought Eddie was like the master of murder, but these guys, these guys poke you pretty fucking hard. Oh shit! Ah! Why didn't I reload in the menu? Why didn't I not do that? That was a stupid thing I didn't do! Gotcha, you little bastards. You missed! Feel the gun! Feel the power of bullets! These guys take a lot of fucking hits. Wait, no, why? There we go. Fucking finally, I can actually see who I'm shooting at. The camera angles are so fucking bad. Sometimes you can't. There you go. Oh shit! It's hunting season. No! Oh, wow. That was like the slowest stab ever. And I took it like the, the slowest bitch. I'm hunting pyramid heads. <laughs> get away, get away, get away. Do these guys like share a health pool or do I have to kill one after the other? If I die with all this health and all these bullets, then I don't deserve to beat this game. Shit, run! Run! No, James, you fool! Do the thing with the gun. Like, not die. Even with the fucking spears, they're still slow. Not as slow as this fucking gun. ba da ba Taking longer than I want, though. Oh, wait! They're done! Yeah, that's right. <laughs> you fucking assholes. Look at you. You both look like fucking dorks. <laughs> oh, another, another pyramid on the bobby? <laughs> I've got you, Rose. I'll never let go, Jack. I'll never let go.
Hey guys, I'm gonna go fight the last boss. You two just stick around. Pyramid Head won't move anymore. It looks like he's holding something. A rust-colored egg. Okay, there's an egg shape there. I don't know what egg to use. Do I have to use both of them? I'm gonna use both of them, I guess. Why does this one say it's about the size of a quail's egg? And this one says about the size of a quail's egg. Shouldn't they both just say it's about the size of a quail's egg? Whatever. We're gonna use the scarlet one. And then we're gonna go over here and use the other one. I don't even know if I have to do that. I'm just gonna fucking do it. Because I don't want any, any eggs in my inventory. Would you want to carry eggs around in your fucking pocket when you're trying to fight monsters? At the end of the day, you go in to get your keys and you get, ugh, fucking yolk all over my hands. Gross. Now, initially, when I entered this long hallway, I did not pay attention to the entire conversation. But apparently, that's important to the ending. So we're gonna listen to the whole Mary? conversation. What do you want, James? I, uh, I brought you some flowers. Flowers? I don't want any damn flowers. Just I go like flowers. home already. Mary, what are you saying? Look, I'm disgusting. I don't deserve flowers. But that's why I got the flowers, to and hide the your face. And the drugs. I look like a monster. Oh, baby, you looked like that beforehand. I just at? have low standards. Get the hell out of here. Leave me alone already. I'm no use to anyone. Be dead soon anyway. Sooner than you maybe think. Maybe today. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe in an hour. It'd be easier if they just kill me. But I guess the hospital is making a nice profit off me. They oh. want to keep me alive. More incentive for me to kill her. Are you still here? I told you to go. I mean death. I want I want the fucking don't good ending, that. so don't give me that shit. James. Wait. <laughs> Make up your don't fucking mind. Go. <laughs> You're gonna regret that decision. I said, please, James, tell me I'll be okay. Tell me I'm not going to die. <laughs> I can tell you you're not, but I will help you. Is that the whole conversation? I know the conversation is actually pretty sad. When I first heard it, it was very heartbreaking, but I mean. I already know the story, so, and, you know, I'm older now, and I'm jaded, and I have no soul or heart or feelings, so it's really hard to relate now. But it is, it is honestly sad. Set me free, why don't you, babe? Get out my life, why don't you, babe? Ooh, cause you don't really love me. You just keep me hanging on. Get out, get out of my life. Here we are, guys. This is it. The finale. James, you know what to do. Uh, not go that way. That's what you're not supposed to do. Fuck up there, James. Use your legs. You have legs. Use them. Oh, oh my god, these fucking camera angles make it hard to maneuver. Look at this. I can't fucking run up the stairs. He's stopping. Did you fucking pull a muscle or sprain your leg? Holy shit, dude. Climb the stairs, I'm holding the run button, Jesus fucking Christ, oh my word. Here we are. Hey, what's going on? Are you Mary or Maria, for fucking real? I, I don't know. Are, are you either, either one of them? Oh yes, you're one of them. Hi Mary. When will you ever stop making that mistake? Wait, you're Maria? Mary's dead. You killed her. Maria? It's you. But I don't I told you she'd you fucking anymore. come back. What? You must be joking. But I can be yours. I'll be here for you forever. I haven't treated you well at all. And I'll never yell at you or make you feel bad. <laughs> um that's what you wanted. No, I wanted a wife that wouldn't die. How can you throw me away? Because I, I don't know you. Now. It's time to end this nightmare. No, I won't let you. You deserve to die too, James. You just said you wanted to be with me. Oh shit! I'm so glad I didn't bring you home. Oh, table fight number three. James, you have to run away though. I'm stuck on the bed. I'm stuck on the bed. 
No, aim at, at the fucking bitch. Oh my fucking god, the camera angle. Oh no! Ah! Moths! Fuck off, moths! Shoot the bitch! Shoot him! Oh my god, moths again! Ah! Ah, I'm like a fucking flame! They keep flying right at my face! Fucking moths, fucking moths, fucking moths. This is gonna be a slow battle if those moths keep getting me. Like, every time I, I stop, I get fucking assaulted by moths. But then she gets close, so I have to run away, right? So it's not like I can just hang around. Mary, do me a favor and die fucking horribly. Oh, I got two shots off that time. Fuck you, moths. I got two shots. You've been assaulted sexually by one table today. You will not be sexually assaulted by another one. Oh no, the moths. Eat the bullet. Mary, no, don't touch me. Get away from me, you whore. I saw you die like 15 times. Now it's time to die one more time. Get away, fucking bugs! Get the fuck away! Holy shit, goddamn! They're relentless! They're fucking relentless! Fuck you, Mary. Oh, I got you! Maria, you bitch! Yeah, choke on your own blood. You fucking bitch. Boom! That's where you belong. Lay down so I can smother you with a fucking pillow, just like that. And so ends Maria's journey. Wait, what? Didn't I just kill her? Mary. <coughs> James. Is this actually this Mary now? I told you that I wanted to die, James. Yeah, and I listened I to you. I the pain to end. And it, and it ended your pain, not mine. That's why I did it, honey. I just couldn't watch you suffer. It is sad. No. That's not true. You also said you didn't want to die. But you wanted her to die. You wanted to go get some young tail and you couldn't with this the old hag is, around. I hated you. I wanted you out of the way. Of what? That's horrible. I wanted my life back. You're a scumbag. James, if that were true, then why do you look so sad? Because you wanted you the way you were, not as a diseased monster. Mary? James. Yep, those are your names. Please do something for me. Smother you with a pillow? Okay. Go on with your life. I was gonna do that anyways. In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. This is just repeating her letter. <sighs> you promised you'd take me there again someday. Well, I did in this fucking graveyard. You never did. Well, I'm alone there now. In our special place. At the beginning of the game. Waiting for you. When I said the graveyard was the special place. Waiting for you to come to see me. I think I was right. But you never do. I, I'm doing it right now. And so I wait. Wrapped in my cocoon of pain. And loneliness. And in a coffin. You're wrapped in that too. I know I've done a terrible thing to you. I wish I could change that. But I can't. I feel so pathetic and ugly laying here. Waiting for you. In the ground? Is she writing this while she's on a deathbed? Every or? day I stare up at the cracks in the ceiling. And all I can think about is how unfair it all is. Oh, she wrote this before she died. I thought she was the like in the ground writing this. He told me I could go home for a short stay. It's not that I'm getting better. It's just that this may be my last chance. I think you know what I mean. 
I'm glad to be coming home. I've missed you terribly. But I'm afraid, James. I'm afraid you don't really want me to come home. And your fears have been confirmed. Whenever you come see me, I can tell how hard it is on you. I don't know if you hate me or pity me. Or maybe I just... Maybe you just make him you. sad because he misses you and he hates the situation. I'm sorry about that. When I first learned that I was going to die, I just didn't want to accept it. I was so angry all the time, and I struck out at everyone I loved most, especially you, James. <laughs> That's why I understand if you do hate me. I want you to know this, James. I'll always love you. Even though our life together had to end like this, I still wouldn't trade it for the world. We had some wonderful years together. <laughs> Well, this letter has gone on too long. <laughs> yeah, you're fucking so, telling me. I'll say goodbye. I told the nurse to give this to you after I'm gone. That means that Wait. as you read this... But didn't you just write that, that you were going to come home earlier in this letter? Or is this a new letter? I can't tell you to remember me. But I can't bear for you to forget me. I'll never forget this fucking experience, don't you worry. These last few years since I became ill. I am so sorry for what I did to you. Did to us. You've given me so much. And I haven't been able to return a single thing. Oh, you've given me nightmares and PTSD. That's I'm gonna why need to I see a therapist. For yourself now. Do what's best for you, James. That's the plan. James. You made me happy. Oh, okay. I'm like, what's going on? What is was that the end? And here it is, the final moment of the game, where the little shit walks with James to go see Mary. And that's the end of Silent Hill 2! Finally! Uh, this should have been done at least a week ago, but I was sick, so I had to wait. In any case, uh, it's, a, it's a good game. Definitely not, not holding up as well in 2018 as this is recorded, and I'm sure it'll hold up even less in another 10 years. But it's still good. It's still fun. Uh, it's It still has scares after all this time. I jumped at least once during this game. Uh, I don't know. I feel like the ending is kind of kind of sad, bittersweet. He, he got closure. He finally got to tell Mary how he felt. I don't think that he hated her you know, because it was Mary. I think he hated her because he wanted to be with her as she was. You know, just a happy family. But then he had to deal with her dying. She became uh, a burden on on him. And it was just too much to take mentally. And he probably didn't want to visit her the same way a lot of people don't want to visit loved ones when they're dying. You walk in and you see this person you don't recognize. They're pale, they don't look the same, they look miserable and sad, and it makes you want to cry, you know? Like, if you've ever gone to see your grandparents laying in the bed, and you almost don't even recognize them. Uh, it's, it's happened to me, it's very depressing, and you don't want to go see that person, not because you don't love them, you do. 
but because you also want to retain the memory of who they were in their happiest moments, not when they're on their deathbed looking miserable. I know that my grandma died of Alzheimer's, and because of that, she couldn't even remember anyone around. Even, even though she was surrounded by family and loved ones, she died alone because she didn't know any of us. So as far as she was concerned, she was, she was around strangers when she passed, and it was very heartbreaking. Uh, I was not happy about going to her funeral. I didn't want to remember her that way, and I feel like that applies to a lot of people. Uh, so this, this story is one of the better Silent Hill stories. I do like Silent Hill 1 and 3, they're connected, and also it, it takes a different direction. But it's it's less it's less heartbreaking. It doesn't tug at your heartstrings as much as this game does. But we'll get to those games when we get to them. I'm done with Silent Hill at least until next year. So on the bright side, I have plenty of fucking games to play. And there is one more thing I totally forgot that I had to do with this. Because even though we're done with Silent Hill 2. Technically, we're not really done with Silent Hill 2. And what do I mean by that? Born from a wish, we are not done. I hear that the sub-scenario is short and we're going to get to it. So, look forward to that. Thank you for watching my Silent Hill 2 star play. If you liked what you saw, like, share, and subscribe. I always make this content for people like you to entertain and have fun. And I love doing it. I fucking love games. And I like to share my experiences, even if I'm mostly fucking around 